Recently, I had to implement for a CLI tool a configurable enum. And um, what it does is this enum returns as default a model name. And it should be configurable depending on user's input. And as a MVP, a minimal viable product, I implemented uh, this logic within the enum. And I think it works well. And this is how it is right now uh, in production, so on my machine. And what it does, there are various models like Claude Sonnet and Opus and so forth. And what I wanted to do is to provide an optional minus D parameter with model. And I can specify, I would like to have, let's say, Sonnet 3, 5, uh, sorry, 4, 5, I think is the recent name. And if I run it, you see I get the Sonnet um, 4, 5. So, and how this works is, um, this is fairly simple. So first I have a uh, method matches uh, in an enum. And uh, what it does is it normalizes the input to lowercase and then it checks whether uh, this um, model name contains the uh, user input. And the model name is maintained in a private field. So this is, this is the model name. Okay, this is the first one. And then I implemented a uh, um, method. Um, this is the without any parameters and it just fetches the uh, system property. And uh, and then uh, I pass the this, the value of the system property and say okay if nothing is found I would like to return the default which is this model and um, it works well and uh, how it works this is the entire business logic so what happens here this is from partial match so I'm iterating over enums and then I'm I try to uh, find an enum which match matches and find any which means if there is no match, optional is returned. And in this method, the optional, if not exists, returns, re resolves to a default. So um, it is working. And I think I will keep it this way. It was the simplest possible way to make an enum configurable.